Hey everyone, welcome back to Boots and Bounty Homestead. Do you have an abundance of yellow squash and you don't know what the heck to do with all that? Well, I'm going to give you an easy recipe. I'm going to have it listed down below because I'm just going to do a music over as I put it all together. Recipes down below, the, the link to it, and I will go and copy it down below as well. So you can do either one. Uh, whether you want to copy and paste it and save it or if you want to go to the link and then print it from there that'll be fine either way but this is an easy lemon poppy seed squash bread if you don't have yellow squash you can also use a green zucchini and just shred or uh, peel all the green off of it so that way it comes invisible you don't have to do that with the yellow squash unless your skin is getting a little too thick or you have a little bit older squash that you want to use up make sure that you scrape the seeds out if you need to if they're getting too big otherwise just shred it all up throw everything in a bowl mix it all up and then cook it now i'll tell you if you want to do a loaf pan you will do a loaf pan like a I think it's a nine by five regular loaf pan. This will make two of the nine by five inch loaf pans, or you can do two bunt pans, as you'll see I have, that are six each, or two that have, I think, 12 each, because I have each size. And those will do two pans each. So either way, this will do like two batches of whatever size pan you're using. For the loaf pan, you're gonna bake it for about 50 minutes. Be sure to check the middle with a toothpick. And then with the bunt pan, um, I have the bigger size, which is the cast iron enameled pan that has six in it. And that takes about 20 minutes to bake. So if you have the even smaller ones that have I think it's 10 or 12 on it which are probably about two inch bunt cakes then those will take a little bit less probably 10 to 15 minutes just make sure you check the center with a toothpick only about one time because you don't want to mess with bunt pans because um, they'll deflate if you're not careful but anyways have fun and i hope you like this recipe let me know below mm -hmm. 